Hello everyone, it's time for Morning Briefing. And before we get started, I've got my favorite coffee. I hope you do too. We're going to talk about Steve Tellman. He participated in the Junior World Gliding Championship in Poland. That's pretty cool. We're very proud of him. And here's to him and his coffee cup. The gliding went fine. He's safe and home. Hey, you know there's crazy stuff that happens you just can't believe unless you see it with your own peekers. Well, let me introduce you to a guy. Now, how did he get a name like this? Al Kabir Tate. Did you hear what I said? I don't know. It's his name. He's 32. He dials 911. He tells us he's just checking in. So we ask him, what's his problem? He doesn't have a problem, he's just checking in. And then he goes on to tell us that, hey, there's no sidewalks in Saddle Creek Park. Well, we wanted to help him. He still wouldn't tell us where he was, but of course we were able to track him with a cell phone when he dialed 911. So we went there to help him. Oh, we helped him all right. We helped him right to the county jail. When we got there and started talking to him, he denied, I haven't done this, I haven't done this. So our deputy dials this guy's cell phone number that popped up on the 911 screen. And while we're there talking to him, guess what? His phone rings. Gotcha. So when we're arresting him, he's now got a vape pen with that low-level, nonviolent cannabis resin. So when we arrest him and put him in the back of the car, we get him out at bookend because he's visiting the jail. Guess what? He's thrown down some cocaine in the back seat of the patrol car. He created all of this trouble that night. You're talking about a crazy dude, oh, Al Kabir Tate is a crazy dude. Have a good day.